What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. It is currently 8 o'clock in the morning and today I'm doing a video where I'm going to recommend bands for people who love Metallica. For people who love Metallica, alright? Um, as you guys know, I'm a huge Metallica fan, right? And a lot of my videos revolve around Metallica. And I'm pretty sure some people probably think all I listen to is Metallica. But that's not true. I actually listen to a lot of other bands, um, some other big names, some other obscure names. And as someone who is a huge Metallica fan, I'm going to recommend you bands that I like as a huge Metallica fan. So maybe you will like these bands also. Um, now, I have a bunch of thrash metal bands, but I also have a bunch of bands that aren't in thrash metal. So, first, let's start with the obvious. Um, the other big four bands in thrash metal. So we're talking Slayer, Anthrax, and Megadeth. Um, if you like Metallica, chances are you're probably going to like those four uh, other three bands too. So give those a try. Um, so those are like the obvious ones. And then I have eight other thrash metal bands that I, th I liked uh, and still like to this day um, as a Metallica fan. So there's no particular order. There's eight of them. We're going to go through all of them. First, um, I'm, I'm going to name the band and I'm going to name a song that I think you might like. So first we have the band Overkill, um, pretty good thrash metal band. They actually, if I'm not wrong, this was a long time ago, but I'm pretty sure they released a new album right when Metallica released 72 Seasons. Now I don't know if that was a smart move to release an album when Metallica released their album, but um, I heard that the album was good. So uh, definitely Overkill, give it a chance. and. A song that I recommend is probably Elimination. In my opinion, their, their best song. Next, we have um, a band that I've been liking a lot lately, which is a Brazilian band by the name of Sepultura. Probably the biggest slash best thrash metal band. Or probably just the best band. I'd even go as far to say best band from Brazil. Um, best metal band. And, um, obviously, as you guys know, I love Arise. I recommend Arise. It is just one of the, one of the thrashiest songs I've ever heard. Um, number six, uh, we have Exodus. Um, and this, this band is actually connected to Metallica a little bit because Kirk Hammett used to be in Exodus before he joined Metallica. So, there you go probably might like exodus and i'd probably recommend um and then there were none which is a pretty good song it's also the, the title track i think so yeah exodus pretty cool um number five uh this one is actually it's thrash metal but it's mixed with another genre this is called death thrash yes you heard me correct i remember the first time that i found out that there was a genre called death thrash and i'm like <laughs> what um um basically death thrash is thrash metal on drugs miss that's basically what it is so um but if i could recommend a death thrash band i'd probably go with demolition hammer um and the song i'd recommend is probably human dissection very good song i i, I this is my first time talking about this band. That song is awesome. That song is awesome. Human Dissection is such a great song. Um, yeah, definitely check out Demolition Hammer if you like thrash metal. If you want to upgrade to Death Thrash. Because there's, there's a lot of good Death Thrash bands. Um, so yeah. Number four. Uh, I think you might like Ev Evile or Evil. Still don't know how to pronounce their name. Um... But they're another thrash metal band. They've actually been compared to Metallica because one of their albums, he sounds exactly like James Hetfield. And I'm not lying. Like, oh, like they sound similar. No, he sounds exactly like James Hetfield. Uh, I, can't I can't remember the name of the song, but I will put it up on the screen. That song sounds like a long lost Metallica song. And that entire album, he sounds like James Hetfield. It sounds like a, it sounds like a 
long lost Metallica album. But it is their own band. If I was to recommend a song, I'd probably recommend Thrasher. Um, probably their best song. But yeah, that. Um, next, we have another band called Nuclear Assault. Um, pretty good thrash metal band. Um, and I'd recommend um, Surgery. Pretty good song. I feel like you might like that. Next, we have um, thrash metal band, groove metal band. Um, people don't even know to this day what, what genre they are. But Pantera, um, definitely. And if you like thrash metal, I feel like you would definitely like Hostile. Um, it is just awesome. And probably Domination. Domination and Hostile. There you go. You got two songs. Um, and then for the final thrash metal band that I'd recommend if you like Metallica, uh, one that I love a lot, uh, Creator. Um, I don't really remember where they're from. I, Germany? I don't, I, I don't think it was Germany. Um, but it could be Germany. I don't know where they're from, but all I know is that they are one of the best thrash metal bands, if not the best thrash metal band to come from wherever they're from. I forgot where they're from. Um, and I can recommend you a song, but I recommend this entire album. Um, and the song I recommend is Violent Revolution, which is the title track to the album Violent Revolution. And that entire album is awesome. It's kind of like melodic thrash metal. Now, for some reason, people don't like a lot of melodic metal, but this is so good. It's melodic thrash metal, um, and it's, it's just awesome. It's so cool, and you can listen to that album from start to finish and enjoy every second of it. So, those are eight thrash metal bands, including the other three, big four, uh, that I think you might like as a Metallica fan. Now, if you're a Metallica fan, and you want to discover bands that aren't thrash metal, and you want to see if you like them, well, you're in luck, because I have a couple bands here that I think you might like if you like Metallica, because I like them, so maybe you might like them. So first, we have the obvious one, Misfits. Um, Misfits, not only had, not only were they a big inspiration for Metallica, and not only did they impact Metallica's career, um, it's just really good music. I mean, if you're a Metallica fan, especially like a, like a big Metallica fan, you know that Metallica loved the Misfits. Uh, especially in the 80s, the amount of times, like, there's so many pictures of the band wearing Misfits shirts. Literally, Cliff Burton had a Misfits tattoo. Um, and then to go even further, they had cover songs. They covered Last Caress, Green Hell, and they covered uh, Die, Die, My Darling. So, Metallica are pretty good Misfits fans, a pretty big Misfits fans, and that's how I discovered Misfits. I'm like, hmm. you know, I always see this band being represented by Metallica. Maybe I should check them out. And I did. And now they're one of my favorite bands of all time. I love this band. Um, so, uh, the genre is horror punk. Um, but punk is like... Punk is like the original thrash metal. I, I, I don't want to like go too crazy with that. But punk is a huge like core factor of thrash metal so it's really good um if i was to recommend an album from the misfits i'd probably recommend earth ad that's like their most thrashiest thrashiest they're a punk band but that's probably like their thrashiest album but um if you're a, if you're a metallica fan chances are you're probably gonna like the misfits too um it's just so freaking good. Um, next, we have my third favorite band, which is System of a Down. So, totally out of the thrash genre. Um, System of a Down is just an awesome band. I have never discovered a band that has a single bad song yet to this day. Uh, currently, I'm still, I'm still uh, listening to all their songs, but I've listened to their first three albums completely and their last two albums i've listened to most of the songs and i have yet to find a bad song 
So once I finish, because they only have five albums, so once I finish their last two albums, if I like every song, then that means that, in my opinion, the System of a Down has a single, not a single bad song. So, um, obviously, System of a Down is a new metal band. So, yes, a lot of thrash metal fans don't like new metal. I personally hate new metal. I don't like bands like Korn or Death. I hate Death Tones. You know what? I might make a video of me ranting about how much I hate Deftones, but anyways, I don't I don't like new metal. But Sowed, System of a Down definitely uh, hooked me, and of course it would because funny story. I'm gonna make it short. System of a Down is the whole reason why I'm into metal. If it wasn't for System of a Down, I probably wouldn't be wearing this Metallica shirt, this Metallica hoodie. I probably wouldn't be wearing this Misfits beanie. I probably wouldn't have this Metallica. Po uh, tapestry on my wall. I probably wouldn't have this drum set. I probably wouldn't have anything that involves metal and rock because System of a Down got me into the genre of metal and rock. And to keep the story short, basically I was at my grandma's house in Florida for vacation and I was on YouTube and they recommended me a song called uh, BYOB. I'm like, oh, check it out. At the time, I was a rap fan. At the time, I was listening to rap music. All right? And I listened to it. And then right when I finished listening to that song, I threw rap music out the window. And I've officially been listening to metal for almost two years now. So, shout out to System of a Down. But I love this band. And it's no surprise that it's one of my favorites. And it's also just really good music. Seriously, you guys need to check it out. Um, moving on, we have a death metal band which is called death um i remember the first time i heard death i thought it was going to be one of my favorite bands it wasn't but they do have some really good songs um so yeah uh, you might like death uh next we have mudvane another new metal band i'm pretty sure um but mudvane they're like uh it's kind of like you gotta be really picky with mudvane um, some of them, some of their songs I don't like at all. Some of them I do. Um, for example, I love Dig. Dig is one, probably their best song. Like, honestly, if you're a Metallica fan, you don't even have to check out Mudvayne. Just check out their song Dig and you'll like it. Uh, next we have Disturbed. Um, I mean, what can I say? This Disturbed is pretty good. Um, next we have another, uh, another death metal band, which is Cannibal Corpse. Fun fact, Cannibal Corpse actually covered a Metallica song. They covered No Remorse. So, if you ever wanted to hear No Remorse from Kill em All in a death metal version, well, check out Cannibal Corpse. Um, and then finally, the last band that I recommend. And this is... Wait, what genre is this band again? Oh, this is a melodic metal band. Uh, in Flames. Uh, I've been hooked on this band lately. For only only three songs have hooked me. Um, it was Meet Your Maker, I Am Above, and The Jester's Dance. Check out those three songs. You might like them. So that's it for the video. This video is pretty short, um, surprisingly. But yeah, as a huge Metallica fan, I liked songs from all these bands. So real quick, we're going to go through all of them. Just Rapid Fire, Anthrax, Slayer, Megadeth, Creator, Pantera, Nuclear Assault, Evil, Demolition Hammer, Exodus, Sepultura, Overkill, Misfits, System of a Down, Death, Mudvayne, Disturbed, Cannibal Corpse, In Flames. You probably would like all those bands. Um... And you know what, to even help you guys out even more, I'm going to link my Spotify playlist. Yes, guys, I'm I'm not gonna gatekeep, all right? If you do care about, it, like if you really wanna discover some more metal and some more rock and so just some more good music, I'm going to link my playlist of my metal and rock songs in the description. It's on Spotify, so if you use Apple Music, you're out of luck. Um, but I'm going to be linking my Spotify playlist in the description. 
So that's basically it for the video. I'll see you guys in the next one.